ahead to win the Dubai World Cup 2024. Horses play a very important role in the splendor of the Sheikh royal families of the United Arab Emirates. The rich facilities available to Arab horses are air-conditioned horse stables, spacious green grasslands, special kitchens, bathrooms, medical checkup center, air-conditioned containers for traveling to far-off towns. The horses are nurtured and nourished by skilled staff and veterinarians. The most loving companion of the horse is however the jockey. Female horses are not used for races. Male horses selected for races are very carefully nurtured and trained. All horses are given high security. No one is allowed access to the horse. Public viewing is only available at the race. His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, the Vice President, Prime Minister of the UAE and ruler of Dubai, launched the Dubai World Cup horse race in 1996. The Nada Al Sheba race course in the heart of Dubai was revamped and renamed Maiden Race Course. In 2016, Maiden Race Course was recognized as the first and highest level race course in the world. One hundred and fifty horses took part in the race, a major event in the run-up to the 2024 Dubai World Cup. The USA, Australia, Japan, France, Great Britain, Uruguay, Argentina, Germany, Ireland are the nine countries that participated. Nine races were organized with a total of nine sponsors including UAE Giants Emma, Azizi, Nakheel, DP World, Longines and Emirates. Horse owners including horses from the Sheikh family of Dubai, 10 top trainers in the world, 10 skilled jockeys who rein and ride the horses in the race are the major forces behind the Dubai World Cup 2024.
as the winner of the Dubai World Cup, sponsored by Emirates Airline, makes his way to the winner's enclosure. Ladies and gentlemen, Laurel River! Emirates Airline. To make the presentation, please welcome to the stage His Highness Sheikh Hamdan bin Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, the Crown Prince of Dubai of the Dubai Executive Council. Three awards to the connections of Laurel River. And first of all, to receive the finest trophy of all, we welcome to the stage, collecting on behalf of the late Prince Khalid Abdullah's family, the Chief Executive Officer at Jobmont Farms, Mr. Douglas Erskine Crumb. Well, the Dubai World Cup. Huge congratulations to all involved at Jumbo. Now, time to welcome the winning trainer and a hugely popular winning trainer. This is Bupat Sima. <laughs> And as we put the trophy back down, if you would now, please, everyone, our Maidan race course. <laughs> as we see these moments which will live long in the memory of the Seymour family, the O'Shea family, and the family of the late Prince Khaled Abdullah. In the closing ceremony, the audience were delighted to see a Guinness record of 4,000 drones in a variety of drone shows, laser light and 3D images created in fireworks.
60,000 audience sitting and watching system in the gallery and 8,600 car parking system was neatly maintained. 150 non-resident citizens of UAE were witness to the unprecedented event. Dubai, which has created many records, once again created a world record.